The greater Yellowstone ecosystem hosts the largest concentration of elk in North America. Big bulls display massive antlers that can weigh up to 40 pounds. Each autumn, these become their weapons. The males compete for the attentions of the females, displaying their antlers and bugling a warning to rivals. Nowhere is this pageantry more dramatic than against the magnificent backdrop of Yellowstone. Well, the, the bugling, uh, in, to some extent, is a proclamation of their, their dominance, uh, their territori ter territoriality, uh, and proclaiming that this is, their, this is their group of cows. And in some cases, it may also constitute a challenge to other bulls uh, that may be approaching their group of cows. It's early morning, but the elk have been active since before dawn. Uh, the bulls are trying to round up and corral and keep together groups of cows. And for most bulls, most adult bulls, that could be anything from uh, uh, six or eight cows to maybe as many as 20 cows. And as those cows uh, come into uh, estrus or heat cycle, uh, the bull will attempt to breed the, each of those cows. This will go on for sometimes uh, 21 to 30 days of this type of activity starting in early September and sometimes reaching into uh, early October. This takes a tremendous toll on the big bulls. They come into the rutting season in excellent physical condition following a long plentiful summer. But during the rut, they burn an enormous amount of energy chasing cows and warding off rivals, leaving very little time to graze. By the end of the breeding season in late October, the bulls have squandered much of their summer reserves and must concentrate on regaining that lost body condition before the first snowfall. 